What's going on out there YouTube? This is be your host Beastie Boy Drama back with another tutorial. This tutorial is going to be how to install USB loader and how to install games onto your hard drive that can be read on your USB loader. First thing you need to do is go to this site right here and I will post all the links in the description. So no need to like try to look at this right here. I know I don't know how good you can actually see it on YouTube. But first thing you do is go to this site right here and this site right here is the site for the USB loader. This is where I actually got mine from right here. Uh, this is what's going to pop up and you just go to this view right here. This uh, this is one that you want right here. The USB loader GX easy installer for Windows. Just click view. And hit save and it should pop right up there. Yep. Saves pretty quick. And next you want to make sure you have your SD card in because it's going to install it straight to your SD card. The one that you're going to be using on your Wii. Make sure you remember the drive letter that it's under. I have mine's under the G drive. So what you want to do is double click the USB loader, hit run, next, and make sure you click the USB loader channel if you want that also. It's going to install a USB channel to your Wii and make it easy access for your USB loader basically. So you want to click that too and hit next. Then what you want to do is go over here and put in your drive letter, whatever drive is on there, and mine is on the G. And right there you say it's going to, it's going to install the apps and the USB loader GX folder. And I'm not going to install it because I already have mine I already installed. All I have to do is click and install. And I'm going to show you what that will look like. Under the apps. If you don't have an app for it, it will create one for you. And this is where you put all your apps in for your home brew channel. And USB loader GX. And it will install, I think, three files. The boot.doll, the icon file, and the rev file, I think. And all the rest of the files come when you actually run the USB loader for the first time. And next, what you want to do now is go and get the WBFS Manager. And that's going to be basically a, a program that you can use to install your games onto the hard drive. And it's going to be to format your hard drive so that the USB loader can read it. That's mainly what that's for. And you go to this link that I put in the description. And the one that I'm using right here is the WBS Manager 2.5 times 64. This is the 64-bit. I'm pretty sure a 64 or 34-bit computer can run this one. I haven't really tried the 86-bit one. Just click that one, agree. And again, I'm going to save this one to my desktop for easy access. You can save it wherever that you want, anywhere that you're saving your files at. And it should pop up right there. You will need a a, a WinRAW or either WinZip7 to open it up. Just open it up and double click your setup right here. And mine is already, I already have it installed on this computer. That's why I say I need to repair or remove. Alright, and after you have installed that one. Now you want to make sure that your uh, hard drive is formatted. Alright, now to format your hard drive, all you need to do is, first off, you need to make sure you have at least a, uh, a 4 gigabyte hard drive. I mean, a uh, 4 gigabyte hard drive is going to save you at least one or two files, but the best thing to have is at least a uh, 300 or a 500 gigabyte hard drive. That's where you can save like plenty of games and stuff like that. Uh, what I'm going to do now, uh, the hard drive that I'm going to test it on is going to be a 2 gigabyte hard drive. I'm going to using this just for one game, just because I know it's just a small game and it will work. And just find your drive that you want to format, and you right click on it, and go to format. Now you have to format it in these specific uh, settings right here. You have to go to format it. The file system need to be in FAT32 and the allocation size need to be the, the default allocation size. And you just click start. And it's going to erase all the data if you have any up there. It's going to erase it all. So make sure it be like something you don't want or either a brand new hard drive. And if it is a brand new hard drive, you still have to format it into that settings right there. Uh, you close that down and now you will need to open up your WBS WBFS manager. And then mine was the H drive, so I'm gonna format that and then you have to format it inside of this program right here. You have to also have to format it again. It was formatted successfully now. Then you just load that up. Then you just go to browse and find out where you have your game saved at. And I do have one saved up right here just for testing this one out. And new Super Mario Bros. Wii is only a, a .34 gigabyte. That's why I was using this right here just for demonstration for this 2 gigabyte hard drive. Just click on it and go to add to drive. And it should do it pretty quick. It usually uh, install games into the hard drive about, uh, i say in about a minute. It do run pretty quick. And this is real time right here. That's why I'm just letting it uh, go so you can see how fast it does it. 
and this right here is just part one. I think part two, I'm going to show you how to actually uh, install games, uh, like burn games from your hard drive, or uh, burn games from your actual Wii onto your hard drive. So part two is going to be uh, on the Wii, like how to do more stuff with the USB loader inside of the Wii. But this right here is just how to set up the files, like anything that's not doing, anything that you're not doing on the Wii, this is how to set up the files, like how to set up the USB loader and the the manager for it and how to set up your hard drive for it basically and this thing is running pretty quick and yeah it is taking about a minute 55 seconds right now but this is a pretty small game right here it's only 34 gigabytes and it is complete and as you can see we have it right there and now you're ready to uh, place your, uh, sim, uh, your SD card back into your Wii and you're also your hard drive into your Wii and as soon as you load up the the USB loader this game right here should pop up and just a demonstration what it would look like if you have a lot of games saved on a bigger hard drive I'm loading my actual one that I have my games on and I have that on the eye so I just go to my hard drive that I have it on hit load and these are the actual ones that I have right here now as you can see I have 41 games up here and I still have 374 gigabytes of free space so I could save uh, a lot of games. 40, 41 games only took up 90 gigabytes so uh, you do the math maybe like uh, maybe you can get about 200 games up here or something but I don't know though. But uh, this is part one of the part two. Beast of Boy Drama. Go on.